My name is Charles. I'm from Enugu and I'm a software engineer. I'm expecting a lot. I have like an open mind to what I'm expecting. I just I came here to learn and from the guys that have been doing it since and how they've been doing it and how, how they've been able to sustain themselves in whatever they've been doing and how best to actually do it. So I'm just here to learn with an open mind. I would say the most challenging area of my life has been multiplying my source of income. Currently, I just depend on what I gain as a software engineer. So it's quite hard sometimes when, especially when there's a client that doesn't want to pay your money, constantly changing things and all of that. But then it's interesting. So I'm here to learn how to multiply 10x. So I've known George for some time and we did an internship together. That was where I met him first of all. And I've always known him to be a go-getter and all of that. So one random day I was going through his status. So I reached out to him and tried to find out how I could join and come for it because I knew I needed something like this to help me grow. And yeah. Yes, I would attend the conference a hundred times and I I I really I'm enjoying myself currently because I'm learning a lot and it's it's really taking me to that 10x level that I want to get to. My name is Jeremiah Ketchum. I am coming from Anambra State and um, I am a sales operator in customer service. So I'm transitioning into um, technical writing for Web3 Space. So I actually was, I had leave, so leave of work. So I actually was supposed to be in Lagos with my parents and um, preparing some things as regards to house issues so that then i had to cut short those um, plants then i also i'm supposed to i work with a foundation and i'm supposed to be with that foundation I'm supposed to have been with them for these two days three days this weekend but i'm not with them for the project at this present moment even though i was involved in the planning of that project um one of the challenges i face uh, is uh First of all, lead generation. Okay, so even though I'm transitioning into technical writing, I do sales operations for a particular company. All right, so we have limited, over time we've been using, we've been revolving around the same customers. And so to maintain satisfaction with a particular customer base, you have to keep on increasing your output. So, we have that challenge, lead generation, generating interested lead. And then the other part is having to um, leverage on a platform where I could see persons that would also add value to what I do. And also I can also add a little value of what I have to. So networking is also part of this challenge. Okay, my name is Jetwa Steve Sopluchiko. I'm coming from uh, Onisha, Anambra State. I am into e-commerce, that's selling physical products, leveraging social media. Because of the testimony I had from the previous one, that's 2021, right? So I'm expecting to, to be pushed to, to the area of self-development, financially, and every other aspect as we have learned about the investment and all those stuff. So, um, I'm really, I came to really push 360 in any degree of, in any aspect of my life. That's 360, financially, development, self development, and even investment, and any other thing. First of all, the sacrifice I made, because when I was telling my elder brother that I'm coming for a, a conference in Enigo, he was asking if the conference is free. No, I told him the amount I paid, and... He didn't believe it. I needed to show him the screenshots of my payment before. <laughs> so I made monetary sacrifice and I left my my city to be a... So about the 360 um, Entrepreneur Conference, I think it's a fantastic idea. I feel most business owners, just like I, I told them during my section, most business owners don't pay attention to some other areas of their lives. Okay, we are humans first before we are owners, business owners. 
right? So this this conference um, helps bring to bear these other areas and the need to pay attention to them. So I think it's a fantastic idea, especially when I see very young people in businesses and are being taught about the being like living a wholesome life, even as an entrepreneur. So I had the, the most amazing audience. Of course, you could see the hunger and the the, the, the need to know more in their eyes is, and of course it was a very interactive section and I know that this time next year a number of them will have implemented and have gotten results with the things they learned yesterday.